After 22 long months, Asian elephant Sundara's pregnancy is approaching a critical phase. She looks a bit uncomfortable at the moment. So what do you reckon, guys? Reckon it'll be tonight? Hopefully tonight. That'd be nice. We're keeping a close eye on it at the moment because it looks like, you know, something's definitely happening. Sundara's entering the last stages of labour. And finally, Nandita decides to leave her alone. Sundara gives birth to a 250-pound calf. But she immediately abandons the newborn. Sundara appeared, you know, very agitated. When the, when the baby first drops out and we're just looking for that movement and there's an element of um has it you know has it gone well has it um has it made it out you know alive there was this period where everyone seemed to freeze and stand still it didn't seem to move and you're looking and you're watching and you're waiting and it, and it almost feels like an eternity. <coughs> Nothing seemed to happen for quite a long time. You're holding your breath, waiting to see the calf take its first breath. Um, yeah, it was tough. Finally, after more than three minutes, the calf begins to move. And Sundara returns to her baby. Love that little, that little nudge. It's great, isn't it? Sundara, not the most experienced mum in the world. But once she was back with that calf, and that calf was, you know, trying to get to its feet, she was, you know, super protective of it. She was, she, she was almost glued to it. Good girl, Sundara. Now, the new baby is a female, which is exactly what we're after. Uh, her name is Indali. The zoo has allowed us to name it, so we had a little vote amongst ourselves, and that's what we, what we came up with. It's a pretty little thing, isn't it? Mm. Yeah. The baby's great. You know, and this is a very, very strong little baby. We were happy. We were quite a reserved bunch, to be honest. We don't show our emotions overly much, um, which gets us through, I think. Um, but yeah, we were all pretty chuffed. <laughs> 